based on the title of this video, I'm sure you think you already know where this is going to go. I'll just get right to it. What's going on, beautiful people? I am your favorite cousin, Jess. Welcome or welcome back. Hello, hi, from whatever platform you've tuned in from. Based on the title of this video, I'm sure you think you already know where this is going to go. Don't try and analyze it. Don't overthink it. I'll just get right to it. I've been watching a lot of different genres of videos recently on YouTube, and I've stumbled upon, or maybe, the algorithm working so diligently at its best suggested these specific interesting types of videos that are created by a plethora of creators, some from five years ago and some very recent as in a month ago, all of who have centered these cinepoem style videos around one simple topic. Why do I create videos no one watches? Or better yet, why I choose to document my life. I just want to preface this in the most wholesome, wholehearted, and respectful way possible by simply stating, it was never for you. It's never been about you. One thing at this point I think we can all agree on is that life is short and time waits for no one. Basic cliches and simple concepts that, yes, we all clearly subconsciously understand, yet may have never truly and fully let sink in. I realized that in the grand scheme of it all, eight years ago, I chose to start creating content and continuously put it out there for the world to see. But I've also come to the realization that my reasoning for creating these videos stems from a stifling need to somehow want to preserve the very essence of my life in video time capsule form, if you will, for the future. Tangible memorabilia. When I was growing up, my mom used to have these bulky Polaroid cameras that she would use to capture key moments in her life. And it's crazy that still, till this day, she stores them all in the same beat up green and yellow box and gray old school curtain pattern photo book at the top of the hall closet. Physical memories that she can now look back on and remember certain thoughts, feelings, or experiences from these photographs that she captured from these moments in time from her point of view for anyone interested to partake and indulge in. I don't think she knows it unless she's watching, of course, but this was her creative outlet that she indirectly passed down to me. Thank you, Tootie, for giving me the passion to bask in savoring moments that I never realized I would need to remember for the future. The videos that I create and choose to share are an archive of personal visual works of art and memories, a unique collection of my own personal struggles and mistakes, challenges and motivations, my thoughts and perspectives, my growth and creativity, fun times with good people, things that would have now only been a distant memory of the ones who were present in that exact moment in time. Moments, had I not documented my life, I may never get the chance to relive again. A simple reflection. We will never be able to recreate any of the exact moments we've experienced in life. The emotions, the breeze, the sun, the intricacies, the vibes, the peace. It's a must that I document my life. The sparkle that has been invoked in me by being able to easily see and hear my experiences. 
my insights, my views, my knowledge, the guidance for my legacy, the inspiration and extension of my impact in a video timeline crafted in the context of my own being. Effervescence, the wisdom and sentimental value that I've documented in a commonplace like video book that makes it possible for the people in the world who care and who matter to know me. Being extraordinary is a birthright. And by embracing this intangible quality, I've come to the realization that my life, my legacy, is just as worthy of indulgence as anyone else's. I assure you, in its rarest form, it's all quite therapeutic and grounding, calming and uplifting. The zest of life that has been cultivated and captured through my very own eyes in the form of a video. The ability to become a guiding light for those closest to me. Physical, visual memories. That's why I vlog. That's why I choose to make videos that no one cares to watch. This is the importance of documenting my life. I'm just saying, it's easy not to care if others want to experience your life through your creative content when you've made the choice to simply make room to just show up exactly as you are in any given moment. Being the unique you to appreciate when the time is right for the eyes that are meant to savor it. Mic check, one, two, one, two. Mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. My no strings attached audio diary. That's what I'm calling it. Cause that's how I feel. Oh. <laughs> it's time to lift the words from the pages and just get it out, y'all. Get hip to this new wave audio diary.